All right, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Nick. As always, you can call me Tetra Ninja, and we are once again back playing some near Automata on PC with some mods. Um, so, last session we fought a Goliath, led to explosions and stuff. Pet the pod? What pod? How do I pet the pod? Come here! I want to talk to you! It's a race? Go! Ignore the robots. Don't grab ledges. What is this? Analysis. It is a cave-in caused by the collapse of an open space underground. Why is there such a huge cavern beneath the city? Oh my god, he took a shortcut. Motherfucker. I got that first. I won! I have to jump from ledge to ledge of the tree. I can't go around the branch, probably. There you go. Done. Intense concentration. Oh my god, he flew there! Fuck you! Oh no. Oh dang. Oh fuck. Okay, that's it. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. Go.
Okay, a couple more side quests. There's a lot of stuff in the desert. Desert funeral. Don't got time for you. I thought I would retrieve this girl. Did I already retrieve these people? More people. What's that beeping sound? My ears. What the hell? Is this a pod? Hypothesis. The owner discarded this pod and left it in safe mode. Motives unknown. Why was it abandoned? Pod, reactivate it for me. If it's usable, try to overwrite the original owner with my ID. Activation complete. Access granted. Previous owner ID successfully overwritten. Special weaponry now available. Oh, so you swap pots now. Cool! Swapping between pods. I don't like how it's getting more and more harder to see. Friend. Whoa, sandstorm. Stop pushing. Getting all, getting sand in all the wrong places right now. God. Getting closer. Ever so slowly getting closer. I don't think I'm making any ground. Hey, it's the Oasis. Yeah, found it. Found it. Take a picture. Take a picture. So will this automatically be re-recorded re for that uh, quest that girl wants? Just no option. <laughs> Oh, 
I don't see an option to fish. There is no fishing option. We got something! Killifish. The killifish. Complete. Okay. Much gameplay, much wow. Okay, why is this red? Am I supposed to try to find a fish here? Why? Well, oh, robot here. Hold on. This is one of the places in that resistance member's photographs. Better record the coordinates. Okay, yeah, it recorded. No, I don't go to gaming tournaments. I wish it was a fast travel system. I gotta run all the way back. There's a snake in my boot. This guy. It triggered after I found that android. Next story mission. Should have done that first. Combat hut. Keep getting these copper ores. Kind of boo boo. Jean Paul's melancholy. So we're close to this way. All right, let's go back to the. We'll go back to the village. Machine village. I 
I know, this is that residential area that we were before. Torn book. Go play poo sticks. Poo sticks. Music just starts bumping. What? Don't judge me. Machine fossil. Please tell me I can get there from here. Nope. Can't do it. Can't reach. Oh wait, there's a path here. Let's go back to the machine village. Call to Jean-Paul. Hey, you can't keep your eye on the chat at all times, man. People write spoilers in there. Alright, Candy, you have a good night. We'll see you next time. Bring snacks. You bring the snacks. Need more moose. What the? What was all that about? No idea. Do you want to get involved? God, where'd it go? Where did it go? It's not that far. Not that so far. This machine mother has a child, eh? It's surprising to see them form familial units like that. I wonder if they'll let us examine their brain circuits if we bring the kid home. Your scientific curiosity is getting out of hand, 9S. Joking, I'm joking. Mostly. 9S. <laughs> what a jackass. Yeah, how do they procreate? Interesting notion. Careful, Tubi. 
I'm picking up hostiles. Over there. Easy there, little guy. It's all right. You weren't scared, were you? We should leave before more enemies arrive. Come on, kid. Don't be unreasonable. Any ideas, 2B? I've never dealt with a snot-nosed machine before. You got me. Uh oh. I'll give more you candy. I'm on it. We'll give you gold. Spear attack. Bro. Fucking robots, dude. Are you finished? Your mother is worried about you. She sent us here to find you. So quit with the whining and let us take you home already. Uh, I have to escort you. Are you kidding me? Stay close, all right? Uh... Don't go wandering off. Hey, mister. Was mommy really worried about me? She sure was. So let's go home and have you apologize, all right? Where are you going? That's not the fastest way. We're gonna get jumped. Bro. It's like a wall of spears. Dang. I think I'll put the, the laser better though. Oh my god. Get away from him! Look back for one second, they're all dead. Guys getting mo -opped. Jump faster! Man, this guy's are playing this long range game. What the hell do you got in your pants, man? They keep attacking you like this shit. Got like a stake in there or what? Almost there.
Dang, spear, dude. If they don't move, spear is pretty awesome. <laughs> if they don't move. Get in there. I'm sorry, Mama. I never meant to hurt you. The music, what? Oh, this guy is... Bro! Did I have to go back to the desert to talk to her? How do I continue that quest? Back to the desert again? Dude... Guy's so disrespectful. He called it junk. I can't fast travel yet. Not an option yet. Go to resistance. Alright, let's go to the crater. Store time! That's a weird looking enemy. The ground is caved in. There must have been a hollow down there this whole time. Holy shit. Like a gigantic worm, dude. Should charge those more. Oh, 
Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Wow, these guys are murking me. Dude, don't get surrounded by these guys. Okay, let's let's just break thing here and attack these while they're available to be attacked. I feel like trying to focus on a specific one is not doing us much good. That one's almost dead. There. Oh my God, Angle Anglor. Dude, you die already? You have like no health left. Holy shit. Friendly? Friendly. Friendly. This hallway looks pretty. Oh, good. not friendly. They're rampant. Guys, a drill on top of his head. Drill burr. Yo, fellow Canadian in the chat. Look at all these dead machines. Seems like they've been here for a long time. Crazy what ass door. Place? I don't know. There's nothing like it in the database. Bridge? Ooh. Are they dead? To be. Huh? Look. Aliens. Destroyed alien motherships. Welcome. <laughs> To the graveyard of our creators. Hey, you guys put on pants. You want to fight? They want to fight. You. To be. Look out. My name is Adam. The aliens you seek are no longer here. They were wiped out centuries ago by us, the machines. Wiped out? 
And who knows? Perhaps we'll wipe out the androids next. Machines are weapons capable of evolution. We can grow. We can become aware. Eventually, the intelligence within our network began to surpass that of our creators. You'd probably be surprised at how quickly it happened. You destroyed your own creators? Oh, there's no need to fret about them. They were simple, infantile, almost like plant. I guess you'd say they held no value to us, but the humans on the moon? Now they are interesting. Why them? Because they are an enigma. They killed uncountable numbers of their own kind. Why isn't my Gatling gun not working down here? It's fascinating, don't you think? What could possibly drive such behavior? We have dedicated ourselves to unraveling this riddle of humanity. And now we will allow you to assist us. You were made in their image. Oh, there it is. Assist you with what? It's simple. We need you to locate the humans on the moon and bring them to us. We will then dissect and analyze them in order to drag their secrets forth into the light. Surely you see the attraction in this. Are you insane? We'd never do that! Can you the hell, man? this to be? This guy's I can't get my... I can't go to medium recovery. I suppose this concludes negotiations. The, the hell? The only remaining option is to destroy you. The same way we destroy these pathetic little idiots. What's going on? Time grows short. This year, this is the fate that befell our creators. As for your beloved humans, I guess we'll see, won't we? Oh my god, it's a survival thing. They're gone. The aliens were already dead. Yeah. We better get back to the bunker. Yeah, I don't know why I couldn't access- I can't access him now, obviously, because... Aliens, man. Aliens. Back this way again? What a pain. Stop complaining. Yeah, yeah. Two B, this is Operator Six O. We now have an operational transporter in the city ruins. We're attempting to deploy them at other points as well. About time we had access to those. Care to fill me in? Transporters? They let you transfer your consciousness to a temporary body back in the bunker. I heard some tech guys talking about it a while ago, but I didn't know they finally got it working. Hey, how's it hanging? You again. Your commander told me to build a new access point, so here you go. Oh, and I got the stupid transporter up and running too. Um, thank you? I've known the commander for a while now. She sure is good at pawning work off on people. Next time you see her, give her some lip for me, will ya? So this has a transporter now, huh? Still, transporters are pretty handy. They're way faster than flight units when it comes to traveling between Earth and the bunker. Flight units also leave us open to attack, and they're expensive to operate, too. What?
Does it cost me money? <laughs> Where should I go? Where should I go? I gotta figure out how to get out of here. Oh, there it is. Hey, hello. More Jean Paul. To be, I've been thinking about something. What? Do you think this fellow is being a little too, I don't know, glorified? That's certainly one way to put it. So what's going on here? This place looks familiar. Oh right, it's from that woman's photograph. I'll be sure to get her the coordinates. Music bookmark photo. Good night, Canadian Koopa. Good night, sir. Where should I go? Where's the next mission I want to do? I have no idea what a Type 40 sword is. Go back to the bunker. Location classified. That concludes our report on the events surrounding the alien wreckage. Then they were dead this whole time. The Council of Humanity needs time to formulate a plan. Until then, this information must be kept confidential. Speak of it to no one. Of course. Your next mission is to gather additional intel on the individual known as Pascal. You mean that freaky machine we ran into? This order comes directly from the Council. Knowledge of such unique individuals is essential for the success of future missions. Understood. Back to transporter. Man, the commander sure is a slave driver, huh? And now we have to go back to the city ruins. Why don't we Pick rest up. a little bit, Tubi? It's been a while. I'll rest if I feel like it. Dang. Keep it confidential speaks loudly in the room. True, true, true. Sixteen D. Should last like five seconds.
Don't worry guys, you can always just watch the VOD on Twitch later. Or you can watch it on YouTube, the edited down version. You don't have to kill yourselves to stay up. There will always be different ways to watch. It's not the same though. <laughs> what do you mean it's not the same? I was thinking the exact same thing. It's not exactly like bra sizes. This is where I crash landed. That's a Yorha unit. What? Where? Where? There. Analysis. Yorha Type B body confirmed. It belongs to the missing unit known as 11B. So this is where you landed. Pod, can you access her black box? Negative. Unit 11B's black box has been irreparably damaged. Hmm. Proposal. Unit 2B should recover any usable weapons. Fragmented data detected in memory region. Meaning... New solder! Go AWOL. Violation of regulations detected. However, due to the death of the unit in question, corrective punishment is impossible. I'll bring Maybe. this weapon back to 16D in the bunker. Oh my god. That's a long that was a long way to travel, dude, for one quest. It better be worth it. Holy shit. I don't know what the Type 40 sword is. All I know is I'm returning this trophy sword.
You can convert? Just like that? Dang. What's wrong with the stubs, man? What don't you like about the stubbies? Is it triggering you? Have that stub sword on my back? <laughs> Let's see. Yora issue play 150. Man, that thing's boo boo. 150 to 180? That thing's terrible. Terrible. It's barely better than my fist. Yeah, this will eventually be on YouTube. <laughs> You're OCD. Uh, Pascal's Village. No problem, Chris. Thank you for coming to the stream, bro. No, this is the first time I've ever played this game. <laughs> That's why she's dead. <laughs> because her weapon was terrible. No, she's dead because she couldn't fucking dodge a gigantic red laser beam. <laughs> That's why she dead. She dead, she dead. Gigantic ass laser. Pascal. Um, oh, it's no medicine to be, yes. Those machines cost quite the ruckus, don't you think? We need to talk. Of course. I'll help however I can. Yeah, she needed to get good. Yes, Tell me about the aliens. Yes, Pascal. Yes, Aside from this village, are there any other machines that are cut off from the network? Singing thing? Oh, and of course there's the Forest Kingdom, but it... Forest Kingdom? Yes. It's a vast woodland area not far from here. There's a group of machines there attempting to build a nation of sorts. They're quite hostile to outsiders, however. We can't so much as go near the place. Where is it? Northeast of the city ruins. You should be able to reach it by passing through the ruins of the commercial facility. If you go, however, be careful. This forest kingdom sounds like something we should check out. Oh my god, we just came from the commercial factory, bros! Ah, uh, we just came from there. Didn't we? What's up?
She sure cares about her little sister, huh? Still, it's pretty funny to hear machines talk about siblings. Do you think she just means they were built at the same factory or something? Maybe. Find this girl in the desert. Missing persons. <laughs> yeah, I don't imagine seven eleven food being very good. You done played yourself by getting it. <laughs> Ugh, factory entrance, man. Head towards that marker. Haven't saved in a while. Game is about the world has ended. People no longer live on the earth. From what I can tell, everyone lives on the moon now. And the world has been pretty much taken over by robots. And we play as an android trying to make the world suitable for human life. That's basically what I got out of the story thus far. Let me know if I am incorrect. So if we use the numbers from the resistance camp as coordinates, yeah, we're pretty much standing right on top of whatever they're pointing to. Oh shit, this guy's a level 32. Dang. These guys have like blades as their dicks. How's this thing? What is broken key? Nine S. You die already. This machine. Oh my god. Huh? What for? Call it professional curiosity. Analysis. This machine life forms comrades were destroyed. Driven by that grudge, it lured a resistance member to this location. It then proceeded to destroy him. Are you saying this thing wanted revenge? Oh, come on now. That concept is far too complex for a machine. This corpse. I wonder if it's the resistance member we're looking for. Let's check his memory. Seems this one came here looking for revenge as well. I guess the weaker one lost. <sighs> mm hmm. She is savage as fuck. Moving speed plus three. I really Dang. I hate this. I'm going to feel terrible telling that woman what happened to her friend. It's the truth. 
She has to know. No matter should what we... that truth actually is. We should uh, reorganize all our pod things. Since we got better stuff now. Latas, latas, latas. They come back to life if we repair the androids. I think they fight with us for a bit. I don't know if they do anything else other than that. Not sure, to you, TBH. Map mode. City center ruins. Factory entrance. Let's go, yeah, let's go to the resistance shop. Resistance camp. Oh, what time is it? One, it's been one hour and a half, hour and a half for the second half of the stream. I probably can play for another 45 minutes. Probably one more story mission. One more story mission. <laughs> 